If you're playing Counter-Strike 2 and experiencing constant lag spikes or frustrating stutters mid-game, you're not alone. A lot of players have been reporting these performance issues lately, and in most cases, there's a very simple fix that can make a noticeable difference. So let's walk through a quick and effective method to reduce lag and eliminate those annoying stutters in CS2. The Gear Up Booster application is a powerful tool designed to help you achieve zero ping and maximum FPS. Download the application for free using the provided link in the description. Select the CS2 game and click the Boost button. This will initiate the network optimization process, selecting the best routing settings for you automatically. Download it now. First, click on your Windows search bar and type in Delete Temporary Files. Once the Settings window opens up, you'll see an option labeled Temporary Files. Click on it. Now you'll need to wait a few moments while Windows scans and loads all the temporary data stored on your system. This might take a bit depending on how much junk is sitting there. Once the list appears, scroll down until you find a section called Shader Cache. This part is super important. The Shader Cache is one of the biggest culprits behind in-game stuttering. These cache files are generated by your GPU to help preload shaders for smoother rendering in games like CS2. While they're meant to improve performance, they can sometimes get corrupted or overloaded, especially after game updates or driver changes. When this happens, it causes the game to stutter instead of run smoothly. So what you need to do is select the Shader Cache option, along with any other unnecessary junk you want to get rid of, and then click on Remove Files. This will reset the shader data, forcing your system to rebuild it from scratch the next time you launch CS2. The process only takes a few seconds, and once done, you'll likely notice a big improvement. Less lag, smoother transitions, and an overall better gaming experience. After completing this step, it's a good idea to restart your PC to make sure all changes are fully applied before launching CS2 again. Trust me, this one simple tweak can really help if you're dealing with micro stutters or random FPS drops during your matches. If this helped improve your gameplay, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe for more CS2 performance tips, and let me know in the comments if you want a full guide on advanced stutter fixes or FPS boosting methods.